In Anderson County District 3, we're taking a closer look at the growing issue of chronic absenteeism at Flat Rock Elementary. Our Maya Payton shares how one principal is leading the charge with an interesting approach to get children consistently back in the classroom. The principal at Flat Rock Elementary School noticed a rise in chronic absenteeism from about 16.1% on the state report card two years ago to about 18% in just one year. Yes, yes. To combat it, she has implemented a flamingo attendance reward where students compete for rubber ducks. When classes exceed or meets the goal, they receive them. The ones with the most at the end of the month gets a plush flamingo. Parents bring children into school tardy with excuses because they've been to doctor's appointments and dentist appointments. And they look at me and they say, I don't really understand, but my kid is telling me about this flamingo and how they have to be at school. She says parents can excuse Not a limited number of absences with a note. Beyond that, only medical or death related notes are accepted. Anything else is unexcused. It can be very overwhelming for a student to catch up when they've been out. Like with her yes, lessons, teacher Haley Carwell really makes her students understand sentence. the true value of these ducks. And it seems like just a duck to them, but to us, that duck symbolizes that student was here, they were fed, they were loved, and they learned that day. Chronic absenteeism is 10% of the school year missed. For extreme cases, it can lead to county school board involvement and even family court. And so it does take a long time to go through this entire process, but there are enough stops along the way in the process that it can be fixed. That was Maya Payton reporting. The principal says the causes of unexcused absences, they can be hard to identify, but sometimes parents or families can be experiencing emotional challenges as well as stress.